Wow, it is stuck under there. This is gonna take some work. going on everybody my name is Jeremy thank you for visiting my channel so my passion is exploring and cleaning up places that the average person just doesn't want to go but are genuinely curious about if that sounds like something you're interested in make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell and you'll be on your way to some more adventures with that being said today is operation jet ski rescue I was driving over a bridge and I decided to stop to take a look over to see if I could see anything and lo and behold I spotted a half sunken jet ski stuck under a log this is a very unusual thing to find in this particular creek because it's very isolated and there's nothing really excited going on that would require a jet ski. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna suit up, I'm gonna get in the water, tie onto this jet ski and see if we can get it out of the water. And I'm gonna take you guys along. So let's get started. I got my rope, I'm all suited up. Let's get in this cold water and see if we can hook onto this thing and pull it out. It's not that deep. I don't think it is, but it's a lot more muddier than it was the other day. So I can't really see what I'm doing, but we need a challenge, don't we? Let's do this. A little side note. I forgot my I forgot my shoes for my wetsuit, so I got my work boots on. They're not working at all. So my feet are instantly freezing. Looking like it's waist high water. So this might not be as hard as I thought. But uh, we still have a minute to go. Yeah, it's definitely not that deep. This is, this is definitely a good thing. I don't have to swim, but you see where it's at? That's where I'm going. Man, I can't tell you how happy I am that this isn't super deep. I did not want to go swimming and the water's cold. It was like in the upper 30s this morning. So it's definitely a little too cold to be taking a swim. I gotta make that sacrifice to bring you the good stuff, right? Conveniently, the place you hook onto the jet ski is right there. So, let's see what we're working with here. Wow, it is stuck under there. This is gonna take some work. Looking like it's missing the handle. I'm already tired. The sea dew. It really stinks in here. <laughs> this is turning into a workout. Holy smokes. free. Now I just gotta figure out a way to get the water out of it. Actually, I don't think this is a jet ski. I think this is a wave runner. Somebody pulled the engine out of it. Send it on its way. Here's my plan now. Since I can't get it to not take on water, I'll just walk it down to the bank and just as I'm pulling it up the bank, it'll drain itself. And it's actually not that heavy when it's empty, so this shouldn't be that hard man we're fixing to find out okay so here's the plan I'm gonna drag it I'm gonna drag this thing over to the bank and then I'll start trying to pull it to the top so once we get over there the fun really begins That was really hard. I barely got it out of the water. I'm gonna need some help. And help has arrived. I've brought me along a come along and a whole bunch of rope. And with proper leverage, I'm gonna get this thing out all by myself. 
So let's get started. All right, so I got my rope. I got the cable. I'm gonna go down to the bottom of the hill. I'm gonna hook onto this thing and we'll start pulling it out. <laughs> all right, I'm all hooked up to the jet ski. Now it's time to start pulling it up the hill and we'll see how far we get. I think I got the hard part done. Now I just gotta try and get it up to the road. And I'm half tempted to hook this thing onto my Jeep and just pull it up the hill. I think it's a good idea. I'm gonna look into that. Right now I'm gonna take a quick break and then we'll see what we do from here. <coughs> so after I got my breath back, I started with a game plan on how to get it up to the road from where it's sitting right now. I gotta somehow get the boat down this path to that tree and shoot it straight up that way. I think I'm just gonna say hell with it, tie it onto the Jeep and just pull it up. I mean, what could go wrong? <laughs> Let's find out. Now, is this the smartest thing you ever thought of? Maybe. We're gonna find out really quick. Okay, here we go, let's see what happens. Alright, straight shot. Use the Jeep, get it to the top of this hill, home free. Let's see what happens. Next step, get this thing to the house, chop it up and put it in the trash. Follow me on Facebook if you wanna see that video. Peace.